let's just say character tags because I have that wolf setting up there switch character so we're gonna say that Priam is attacking okay so then what did the character roll let's just say for example a 45 and he's slashing so he hit for five points of damage oh I guess he gets two attacks maybe this time let's say a hundred he failed yeah so he got two attacks based on his level so now we can switch characters try the next one cast spell now this is, will be sweet and I'll be amazed if this actually works I don't remember if I did this or not but let's try to have sonic blast be cast okay all that that does is lowers the spell points or magic points of the caster evidently erase area spell well unless I do the attack now let's see what happens no it doesn't look like that's how it works oh it does that is how it works okay cast psionic blast the wolf and hits for 13 points of damage well I'm surprised I actually implemented that that's quite a bit of work so evidently this wolf is still alive let's switch character Belwar attack ooh this is a thief you can see hide in shadows so let's see what their chance was okay he hid in the shadows so now let's attack let's just say they got a 50 bashes the spike club plus four at wolf and hits for eight points of damage and it's still not dead gets another attack let's just make a mess okay go over to Cynthia thrust ooh look at that critical hit so now each critical hit you roll to see how severe the critical hit was let's say it was about a 30 okay so the right leg the lower bone was broken unconscious four rounds and one third move rate damage from critical was 10 so she thrusts his white hander at wolf 28 total damage and the wolf falls to the ground and then there's the experience you can see that the experience obtained is based on the base for the monster plus the hit points of damage done. It shows the wolves down. Okay, so we're done. Now we can make it where the monster attacks too. Choose attacking monster the wolf. Attacks Priam. Say it rolls a 10. Hits Priam, but it failed to inflict damage. Priam structure points should be reduced by four on the torso here we can adjust monsters so we could adjust its hit points 40 it's condition okay and we can view character status this was just a quick way to look at the characters and see how they're doing You'll notice that the magic points have gone down for Karos, and stamina has gone down a little bit based on the types of actions they've done. And then you can change the round, odd round, even round. Speed factor. This shows who should go first and it's based on the roll that was on the right side so it's based on a random roll plus how fast your character is the types of equipment they have equipped and things like that so the higher the speed factor probably the faster the person goes I also made it where you can view the rules to the game because it was so complicated 
I wanted to have this in here so I could even go back and look. So here's an example of races that you can be and the adjustments to the attributes. I was very excited to play this role-playing system with my friends. I think we had some good times. But, alas, I'm older. I don't really have anybody to play this with anymore. Of course, I could I'd probably try to turn it into an online version. Play over the phone or over a webcam or something. That might be pretty cool. But, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this and thought that it was kind of cool. If not, sorry for wasting your time. Well, that wraps it up. See you next time.